Hey y'all, it's Rita May June, and I'm coming on today with the rest of the items I got out of my May curl kit. And I do have two non-hair related items. For some reason, they wanted to give us some extra non-hair majigs this month. But um, two of the items, I, I, I like them. So um, the first item is the candle by Yum Yum Candle. It is a lemon cello, lime and cello soy candle, and I have been burning it, as you see. And it doesn't take much burn time to fill my home with the scent. Um, very, very good. I um, really, really enjoyed this candle. The next item we got was the Tiffany um, Satin Triangle Scarf. And I got it in blue. And I have been using it. I like the fact that it's very, very thin. So you can see me. <laughs> it's very, very thin for the summertime. Um, you know, so you won't be so hot. And it scratches. I don't know if you can see how it scratches. So when you tie it on your head, it doesn't feel tight. You know, because it, it scratches to form your head. And I'm really, really enjoying this scarf. I use it for pineappling when I have a wash and go. And, um, yeah, I, I'm really glad they gave me this. Alright, and the last item I'm going to share. Um, it is one more item that is the soap that we received. And I didn't give that a try yet, but when I do, I will let you guys know. But the last item is the Oreo Essentials Cleansing Conditioner. And this is a full-size bottle, 8 ounces. And um, it has no parabens, sulfate, silicones, mineral oils, petroleum, alcohols, and dyes. Um, I have used it twice. And it's about down to here. So I have about two or three more uses left. Um, let me get some out for you can use I me mean, before you can see the texture. All right, so it is a whitish, yellowish color, and it is creamy. You can kind of see the oils in the product. Um. It does have a very, very good coconutty smell to it, to me. Um, the first time I used it, I had pre-pulled my hair and twisted it up and then just used it to clean my scalp so I didn't detangle with it. But it still left my hair very, very soft. Um, now, I don't do that anymore. Um, when I'm co-washing, I just run my hair under the water and then section it off and then co-wash um, each section. And I am going to do a video about how I co-wash now. But whenever I'm using shampoo, I will pre-poo and, you know, um, detangle in the section prior to. So, But I will do a video explaining that. But um, the second time I used it, I used it, like I said, to clean each section um, with the conditioner. And I just, you know, rubbed it in my scalp. And I used it as to detangle my hair and then twist it up. And it had very, very good slip. Um, cleaned my hair very good. And um, I really, really enjoyed this product. So I will um, be doing a co-wash, well, cleansing, conditioner wash video using this product um, next wash day. And the ingredients are very, very good. Um, I'm, I really enjoy this product. So I will have a more detailed review of this product coming Probably Monday because I'm going to wash my hair on Monday. And yeah, they are the last items I got in my curl kit that I have used. Um, if you want to know about my hair, this is a braid out. I have been liking braid outs lately. This braid out is four days old. Four days old. Um, I did braid out on um, wet hair and I will be doing a video um, of my braid out routine. Um, I'm really enjoying this for the summer. Um, I think when my hair is set in a style, it lasts a lot longer than me just washing it and going. Um, it really, really does. So, like I said, this is four days old. I do have some frizz, but 
I'm liking it with the frizz and everything like that. It's just, I don't know. It's just, I love it. <laughs> I love it, y'all. So, yeah, that, that video is coming. The um, cleansing conditioner video is coming. And I will break down my braid out video like I um, normally do with the how I, um, you know, the technique of what I do to get the braids in the styling of my hair, and then how I maintain it. So look forward to that. And um, if you have any, you know, requests of videos you would like me to do, because um, I think I'm getting to a point where it might just be reviews, um, because I think I'm going to stick with braid off for a while. So um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to be doing a whole a lot to my hair. I just want to style it. And let it be, like I said, this is going to hold me out until um, next wash day. I'm looking for styles that's going to hold me from week to week. So I can be very low manipulating with my hair. At night with this, I'm, I don't do any rebraiding. Um, I will show you guys what I do. But, um, yeah, I don't want to have to be, you know, doing a whole lot to my hair. Just, you know, to maintain a style. Or to have a style. So I'm just embracing my frizz. And I'm embracing the way my hair is going to be. And I'm loving it. The bigger it gets. The frizzier it gets. So yeah. <laughs> so that's it y'all. I just wanted to come on and share those last items. Be looking forward to new videos next week. And um, yeah. I'll talk to y'all later. Alright. Bye.